Okay. Now, Pat runs a uh, uh, summer theater up in Traverse City. Does he still do that? Yes, he's part owner of that theater. Okay. So he's he's familiar with Michigan, right? He's probably spent oh, many sure. a summer here. Sure. Um, how did you put together his coming out? Coming to the club? Yeah, well, coming out to do the... The, was he coming to do a club date so he could do the film, or did he do the film because he was coming to do a club date? A little bit of both, actually. You know, when we said, when do you want to shoot it? I talked to uh, Doug Sanders, who did some of the uh, the writing for it, and um, who, by I'll, I'll mention, is running one of our cameras right now. Right so there, you go. Right. I mean, this, this is the hometown movie crowd we're talking about. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> and another just uh, absolute brilliant man, John Tatarski. <laughs> Yeah, it was <laughs> and and Scott and Drew, the and whole Scott crowd, all the all, all the guys were in the building, this, right? Yeah. And uh, uh, we arranged a date, yeah. and when we found a date that we were going to be bringing him in, we thought, why not have him work the club as well? It's kind of yeah. a two birds with one stone. Plus, it worked out that the Village of Holly election was going on at the same time, so it was a three for one deal. Mm -hmm. We had a, a lot of laughs. We made a short film, and Pat got to sell out a couple shows at the Holly Hotel. That's 